Hello agents and welcome to another division video. I finally got back from the trip to France and this is my first video and in this video I'm going to show you the defense build. Uh, it is a shield build. Uh, one of my subscribers asked me to make a good PvE uh, defense build and here it is. Uh, in the beginning uh, I will show you the building details and after that you can see uh, underground gameplay with this build uh, uh, it was underground with two phase operations and one directive enabled it was pretty hard but uh, it seems that uh, shield in this build is almost uh, undestructible it really protect you from everything so let's start guys Okay, for my weapons I decided to go with two MP7s, uh, so far I didn't like that weapon because of the small magazine, but the damage uh, wi which these two guns are doing is uh, insane, not insane but uh, very very nice. Uh, if you're looking at the primary DPS toughness and skill power you won't see nothing spectacular, but the true power of this build coming from the shield. Uh, but without further ado, let's check out the weapons. Uh, my primary weapon is MP7 with 19% crit hit chance, uh, base damage 15.7k and the talents I have on him are destructive, responsive and competent. Uh, I'm not going to talk about details uh, of the talents, you all know uh, what these talents are. Uh, my mods are extended mag uh, with uh, crit hit damage and rate of fire you want to stack critical hit damage uh, on your uh, smg because they already have pretty high critical hit chance it's uh, native uh, crit hit chance for uh, every smg on this one is 19 percent so you want to stack crit hit damage as much as you can uh, so my Optics are pro red dot side with crit hit damage, headshot damage and crit hit chance, uh, loud vent break, again crit damage, headshot damage and optimal range, and uh, small grip with crit damage, reload speed and accuracy. Uh, for my secondary I also decided to test another MP7 with a little bit different talents. This one got 20% crit hit chance, 15.9k uh, base damage, uh, competent, adept, to increase a little bit critical hit chance, and responsive. Uh, responsive is uh, damage increased 10% closer than 10 meters to the target. Uh, I think these talents are uh, doing pretty good job uh, when they are combined together uh, with the shield. So that's it guys for uh, guns, uh, the mods on this one are almost the same like on my primary weapon, it's extended mag with crit damage rate of fire, which is already pretty high on the uh, MP7. Uh, I have again crit hit damage stability optimal range, uh, good thing is that if you can uh, stack optimal range on your SMG it will help you. Uh, in a way that you can uh, target your enemies a little bit far away uh, because uh, MP7s got a pretty short range. So optimal range is a good option to go on your mods. Uh, again, uh, loud vent break, crit hit damage, stability and accuracy. Crit hit damage, accuracy and optimal range for my small grip. Uh, okay guys, let's go to my... Uh, gear items. I decided to go with Barrett Bulletproof Vest. It is not uh, necessary for this build, but I did try with the Reckless and I didn't feel uh, good with the Reckless. Uh, all you all know what Barrett uh, is giving you. Uh, it is a vest uh, with no skills on cooldown, increase your skill power by 10% uh, and uh, your shield is uh, skill based uh, actually. Uh, one skill on cooldown increases damage by 5%, you will always have one skill on cooldown because you're running with the shield. And two skills on cooldown increases armor by 10%. Uh, for my uh, major attributes are exotic damage, resilience and health. 
and I have increased skill XP which is not important it will be better if it's ammo capacity uh, my mods are proto the firearms mod uh, with skill haste both on my vest ok let's go uh, on my mask it's a defense mask I rolled firearms with 7.5 enemy armor damage and 17 blind death resistance this is will this will be better if it's a uh, burn resistance but uh, I don't have a mask like that ok the mods are uh, stamina with skill haste for my uh, uh, knee pads, defense knee pads, uh, rolled electronics 3.5 enemy armor damage, 30% bleed, 33 burn and 32 disorient resistance uh, pretty good uh, knee pads got pretty nice protection and the mods are uh, firearms with health and uh, this is important guys uh, prototype performance mods all four of them are 4% ballistic shield damage uh, many people don't know uh, it's not going to uh, increase the damage you are receiving uh, it is going to increase the damage you are giving uh, over the shield your shield will increase the damage of your weapon the, we'll come to this part later when I'm going to show you my skills and my talent so this is important for this build be sure to have a uh, ballistic shield damage uh, I was testing some other performance mods but uh, seems that this works the best with this build uh, ok <coughs> this is also important part of the build it is resourceful backpack uh, let's check it out all healing applied to you is also applied to your skill object that means that when you pop your booster shot you will heal yourself and your shield because the shield is your uh, skill object so this is uh, pretty important for a build you should try to do the build with this resourceful backpack uh, ok uh, it is uh, major attribute skill power and the minor attribute is ammo capacity this is exactly what it needs to be for this build it is rolled firearms uh, electronics with health and again uh, ballistic shield damage I didn't have uh, all 4% ballistic shield damage mods so I'm having this 3.5 so that's it for a uh, backpack my gloves got the double uh, weapon damage uh, the defense gloves uh, rolled stamina and I'm having assault rifle damage, critical hit chance and SMG damage uh, if I decide to go with the assault rifle as my secondary weapon which can come pretty handy if you are uh, in uh, some long mission and you stay out of the ammo as I did in the one part of this gameplay I'll show you later then this can be uh, pretty useful so uh, they are rolled uh, stamina uh, 12 uh, 1270 so these are nice gloves ok let's go to my holster it's defense holster nothing spectacular here but I do have a reload speed it is pretty important if you're running with the mp7 which have a small mag and with extended mag it's like 44 bullets uh, and the rpm is pretty high so you are uh, empty your mp7 in a matter of seconds and the reload speed is pretty important so you can reload faster uh, ok uh, that's it uh, the mod is again uh, 3.5 ballistic shield damage let's go to my skills and my talents uh, I always running with the booster shot ok because booster shot will increase your damage will increase your critical hit damage uh, critical hit chance I'm sorry uh, it will increase your uh, damage and resistance for the affected targets in addition to normal healing effect I'm sorry uh, I was talking about the scanner 
sorry this is booster uh, so that's it uh, when you pop your booster shot you will also heal your shield and this is going to be uh, very uh, handy in a situation when a uh, great number of enemies are shooting at you so uh, that's it uh, my second skill is uh, assault shield okay i decided to go with this one a keeps a shield that grants the user's weapon increased damage uh, knockback accuracy and faster reload speed so this is the best way to go between other shields so i'm running with the assault shield it got uh, great health it's 800,046 health power uh, it increasing the damage of your weapon by 24.5% this uh, damage uh, is increased uh, with these mods I sh I'll show you uh, damage resistance is 10% threat increase 200% cooldown is 26.30 seconds it is pretty low cooldown and uh, believe me guys you will see in a gameplay this shield seems to be indestructible uh, and because I'm playing solo most of the time I decided to go with the recovery link so that's for my skills let's check out my talents real quick uh, I was running with uh, critical save I'm having this uh, strike back reach low health to reduce active skill cooldowns by 20% uh, on the move you will always killing uh, hostiles on the move and it will uh, reduce incoming damage by 15% for 10 seconds and one is none headshot a hostile to have 50% chance of not consuming the bullet uh, it will happen uh, many times because uh, you are always uh, shooting from a close range and SMGs are pretty accurate and uh, you can really uh, increase uh, your damage with uh, one is none talent so uh, let's go quickly to my character this is my primary weapon firearms six and a half thousand stamina four thousand and electronics four uh, weapon damage critical hit chance 27 percent critical hit damage 82 percent headshot damage 62 percent little bit of accuracy range is 19 meters which is pretty nice for uh, SMG reload time is uh, uh, really good it's 1.8 seconds because I have a reload speed bonus on my holster and the shield is giving you some reload speed bonus uh, assault rifle damage from the gloves SMG damage bonus from the gloves I don't have any damage to elites but the build is working fine for PvE I will test this build in the last stand but in some other video uh, enemy armor damage this is pretty important also for PvE and PvP it's 26% okay skills skill haste uh, 9% health protection from elites coming from my vest I think exotic damage resilience bleed blind death and burn resistance this blind death will be better if it's shock but it is what it is and that's it guys I'm having a lot of increased skill XP that's it for a build uh, now when I'm uh, back uh, I can uh, upload uh, many more videos in the upcoming weeks uh, the first thing I'm going to do these days is I'm going to try to answer the, all of the guys who ask questions or comment on my channel while I was away uh, and I want to say thank you guys for being my subscribers this is the defense build if you like the build please comment uh, ask questions 
subscribe uh, or like a video it means a lot to me it, it's really helpful to growing a channel so that's it guys i see you in my next video enjoy in the rest of the video which is a gameplay with underground two face operations see you Sending you some coordinates. Some data we need just got itself captured down in the tunnels, and I need you to get it back. Hostiles detected. Objective updated.
visibility reduced. have been detected. leaving impacted area. Making it nice and easy. Objective has been updated. Tighten up the gun! Hey. 
Visibility reduced. Returning to normal levels. Please open the door. I'm begging you. You're here to rescue me, right? Right? You really saved the day. Tango's inbound. Let's deal with them, and then I've got something for you. Morning. Incoming hostiles.
Next time I do this, I'm bringing ten more guys. I'm guessing the cleaners aren't real happy with you right now, but I am. Thanks for bringing this in. With that intel you brought in, we've been able to pinpoint the location of one of Joe Farrell's lieutenants. Taking him out now could prevent a whole lot more pain later. Alert. Hostiles detected. Alarm detected. Yeah. 
Glad you had our back. <sighs> You're one hell of a shot.
visibility reduced. Warning. Hostiles detected. Now leaving impacted area. Visibility reduced. Now leaving impacted area. Visibility reduced. Now leaving impacted area. Warning. Heavily armored hostile detected.
value target. It's going to make the streets safer for everyone. 